hello everyone welcome back to my channel i am here to do y'all daily y'all y'all sunday y'all daily summons for may the 28th 2023 we are reading the shramity chapter 30 in the old testament let's begin and if i have to stop i will it shall happen when all these things have come on you the blessing and the curse which i have set before you and you shall call them to mine among all the nations where the Lord your God has driven you. This is what Gina is saying, okay? And that includes the ones that are out of space, like Africa, um, um, China, Korea, okay? And return to the Lord your God and obey his voice according to all that I command you today. You and your children with all your hearts and with all your soul, okay? Whatever they're saying. That the Lord your God will release you from captivity, have compassion on you, and will return and gather you from all the peoples where the Lord your God has scattered y'all, scattered you, is what Gina is saying, okay? Okay, this is her soul talking, y'all, to be honest. If your outcasts are in the uttermost parts of the heavens, from there the Lord your God will gather you, and from there he will bring you back. See, the way I said, the spirits have a choice if they want to come back or if they don't. Or this is saying the Most High is going to give us another life, okay? We're going to live the real life, okay? This is the real reality, okay? Not this game system we in, the matrix. The Lord, your God, will bring you to the land which your fathers possessed and you would possess it. So you younger generations. If you are born after 95, that's what they're talking about. So y'all real, y'all fathers know, y'all mamas know, y'all grandmas, y'all grandpas know. Okay, they know how it is. Like, it's time for y'all. Okay? So get the fuck out the game system, okay? He would do you good and increase your numbers more than your fathers. The Lord your God will circumcise your heart and the heart of your offspring to love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul that you may live. See, do or die. The Lord your God will put all the curses on your enemies and on those who hate you, who prosecute you. You shall return and obey the Lord's voice and do all his commandments which I command you today. The Lord your God will make you plenteous in all the work of your hand, in the fruit of your body, in the fruit of your livestock, and in the fruit of your ground. For good, for the Lord will again rejoice over you for good, and he will rejoice over your fathers. See? If you will obey the Lord your God's voice to keep his commandments and his statutes, which are written in the scroll of the Torah, if you turn to the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul. See, they want you to turn away from the real one. For this commandment which I command you today is not too hard for you or too distant. It is not in heaven that you should say, Who will go up for us to heaven and bring it to us and proclaim it to us that we may do with them? Neither is it beyond the sea that you should say, Who will go over the sea for us and bring it to us and proclaim it to us that we may do it? Or it's about me. But the world is very near to you, okay? Then it's a song like that. Who got the most heart around this bitch? But the world is very near to you in your mouth and in your heart that you may do it. Behold, I have set before you today life and prosperity and death and evil. For I command you today to love the Lord your God, y'all gods, y'all real ones, to walk in his ways, well, his, your real one, and to keep his commandments, his statutes, and his ordainments, that you may live and multiply, that the Lord your God may bless you in the land where you go in to possess it. But if your heart turns away and you are not here, but are drawn away and worship other gods and serve them, I denounce to you today that you will surely perish. See, you will not prolong your days in the land where you pass over the Jordan to go in to possess it. I call heaven and earth to witness against you today that I have set before you, before you life and death, the blessing and the curse. Therefore, choose life that you may live, you and your descendants, your kids. 
to love the Lord your God, to obey his voice, and to cling to him, for he is your life and the length of your days, that you may dwell in the land which the Lord swore to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Asia, to Jacob, to give them. Okay, y'all, that is Deuteronomy chapter 30 in the Old Testament. Hope y'all enjoy now. Peace.